Hi guys, in this video I'm gonna give you a walk through the new layout for beginners using the new Twitter version and rebranded X platform. First of all guys, I assume you already download the app, you already create your X account. Let's launch the app. First thing you wanna see on the lower left corner is the actual house icon which provides a feed, something that is recommended for you as you can see on the top left corner. And on the right side, you can click on people that you're actually following. This is very similar to uh, what you usually see on TikTok. You have a feed that is coming from people that you're following. And you have a feed that is currently recommended from whatever platform you're using. In this case, we have recommendations on For You from the actual Twitter. So this is what is going to happen when you click on the lower right corner. Uh, so this is what is going to happen when you click on the actual house icon. The second icon is the actual magnifying glass. Here you will have, first of all, options what is trending for you in your particular niche based on your profile. Are you a public figure? Are you an entrepreneur? Are you into entertainment? Then you will see everything is kind of filtered and segmented into trending. Then you have news, then you have sports, then you have entertainment. It is very similar if you usually end up on the YouTube trending page. First, you have trending videos on YouTube and then everything is kind of broken down into different sections, which is what is trending in entertainment, then what is trending in sports, what is trending in news and what is trending overall. Something like a, a Google trending page with what? top 30 currently uh, trending topics with trending hashtags. Then if you look back down again, you will see the icon which you have like a double figure. If you click on the double figure in the middle, you will see that there are new functions that is called communities, which essentially it's a premium function. If you want to create your own community, you got to first of all opt in for the subscription and then you click on the top right corner you will see that only premium verified subscribers can create the communities. So this is very, very interesting. Uh, what I discover, I don't usually, uh, you know, interact with communities, but when you simply go on the communities and when you try to search or look in inside some of these communities, you see that there are a lot of things, a lot of information. Uh, as you can see over here, uh, very dangerous you see a lot of bots are promoting stuff. So you want to make sure that you're only interacting or clicking to the places where you exactly know. If you don't want to see that, uh, there is a special option. Uh, you go where you see the three dots next to the discover and, and communities and you can simply click see less of this. So essentially you're not going to get recommended the groups and the conversations in these communities if you're not up to this. Uh, Going back down again, you have the notification bell. If you click it, this is what you're going to get uh, as uh, notifications when someone actually mentions you or somebody posts a reply on your comment. This is uh, also something very helpful and very common sense if you uh, on if you use any other social media. Everything is, is very, very similar. And the last icon, of course, next to it is the messages. This is where you're going to find any communication, any messages with people that you know, people that you reach out or, or, or someone who actually wants to reach us out. Again, messages are available for you only if you allow people to send you messages. And remember, when you go on the gear icon in the top right corner, you can actually opt out and not let people to send you messages. This is how a lot of these big brands and big companies, they have a one official account where they just post content and, and you know create brand awareness. And they have a separate account which support. You will, you will go and you will see there's a TikTok account and there's a TikTok support. There is a YouTube account and there is a YouTube support, right? Because they're going to uh, drag the attention from you know maintenance and services and, and help away from the actual brand. To a completely different account so this is what probably you want to consider if you uh, plan to run a brand or, or a company uh, this is how things are actually split and and essentially you will have in one place only the good stuff and on the other account only the bad stuff only the complaints and the issues 
For more information like this guys, subscribe and come back for more. Hi guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to delete your Twitter account after the recent updates and rebranding from X. First thing first, you want to launch the actual Twitter app. You click on the X, then you want to find your profile picture, which depends on your update version, you will have it on the top left corner. You click on your profile picture and then you want to go down where it says settings and support, the last on the left corner. You click on it and then you want to scroll all the way down to the section where it says your account you click on your account and here you will find the last option which is deactivate your account so this is very important twitter and rebranded version of x does not have a menu that it says delete your account they have the only menu which says deactivate your account meaning that you have to deactivate your account by scrolling all the way to the end click the red deactivate and like any other social media platform, they will give you a 30-day grace period in which you might change your mind and reactivate your account. Meaning that how are you going to go about it? Well, all we got to do is to log in back into your account with your credentials. So this is very important. Remember, I showed you how to delete or deactivate Facebook, Instagram, uh, TikTok, all these platforms are at least offering you two options right at the get-go, either deactivate or delete. In the case with X or Twitter, right, you only could deactivate, which means delete. I know this might sound confusing, but it is what it is. So when you actually choose to deactivate your account and you don't go back and log in in the next 30 days, your account simply will be deleted. I want to make sure that you guys realize this and understand what will actually happen so make your plan and 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 do exactly what you expected to happen okay if you're really planning to go off grid and and really you know diminish and delete everything that you previously posted uh, you're going to delete it and most likely going to download your data if not if you just want to go off grid well it's a little tricky with with x and twitter like i said you can do it but then you have to log in back in the next uh, 29 30 days right otherwise you're going to lose your account very important there is no option to just deactivate and you know keep the account on with uncertainty like we have this option with facebook meta and and ig for more uh, videos like this guys subscribe and of course come back for more hi guys in this video i'm going to show you how to make money on twitter with the recent updates on the monetization system let's launch a twitter app first then you want to go ahead and click on the top left corner where is your profile picture then you want to look at the last option which is monetization you want to click on monetization now there are a couple of requirements over here some of them are related to the subscription and having the the premium but the other requirements simply numbers as usual so first thing first eligible creators can sign up for monthly subscription or receive their payouts for ads revenue sharing so two options first if you are a creator you can get subscribers and when people subscribe they're gonna pay you a small monthly fee as a being a subscriber Second thing, you're going to have a revenue split with Twitter, with X, through the uh, ads revenue sharing. Similar options we have on YouTube and, and TikTok, right? But let's click over here, subscriptions. Let's see what are the requirements. So first thing first, you have to get verified. You have to get verified. This means you have to provide a government issued ID, uh, you have to have 500 followers at least you should have been active on the platform for the last 30 days meaning dead accounts bot accounts right uh, stuff will not be eligible and you have to be at least 18 years old and again if you click get verified you're going to see how this actually works are you individual you know are you organization if we click on the second option over here, it's for the ads revenue sharing. Earn income from ads served in the replies to your post. You know how 
you go through the thread of some like uh, nice post that is engaging and you try to read the comments right and in between comments you will see ads you will see uh, a lot of companies promoting stuff that sometimes are related to the topic of the video sometimes they are not and this is the moment you, you you simply realize that oh that this is an ad because it's 100 percent not related to the post so let's click on it this is how it's going to work subscribe to the premium or verified organization right you have to be premium user you have to pay uh, on twitter okay second is second requirement is to have at least 5 million impressions on your posts within the last three months we're talking about combined okay guys don't worry about it so for the last three months i believe it's very likely for you to get the 5 million impressions if you post regularly daily I'm speaking if you don't post that often well then you might you might have an issue and the third uh, requirement is the same as the first uh, monetization option which is to have at least 500 followers so if you pay for youtube premium right if you verify yourself if you uh, right if you have this 5 million impressions and you have over 500 followers you can simply be eligible and you can uh, get i don't know how much money i read the comments of first batch of people some of which big accounts guys over 100k followers uh, they were claiming they were paid like five to twenty thousand dollars and this is just from the ads in the comment section so how how does it work i explained to you they publish something like say let's say breaking news and they write a small post and they, they they have like a video or picture and in the comments you see a lot of people you know contributing to the post and in between the posts you will find these ads this is how the whole ads revenue generation is coming from okay for more tips and tricks like this guys subscribe and come back for more hi guys in today's video i'm going to show you how you can share any tiktok video on twitter very easy guys very simple first thing let's launch the tiktok app and let's scroll through the feed and let's try to find a video that we want to share right has to be something that other people don't have right just think about you sharing tiktok video to some of your friends on twitter because they don't have the tiktok app right so let's say we want to share the jeff bezos interview here right all we gotta do is to click on the arrow okay under the comments and then you want to scroll down this menu on the side all the way to the x platform over here this is where you can essentially click and share and this will become a public post on your twitter account very nice guys very easy very simple for more tips like this guys subscribe and like this video hi guys in today's video we are going to go through what is hi guys in today's video we're going to go through what is the premium package from twitter and x what they offer you how much you have to pay and what you're gonna get at the end of the day let's launch the twitter app first so guys if you scroll down you will have a premium section in your settings right under the monetization when you click on premium you will see that premium plus is the current package offered from the x platform so first of all as you can see they're going to offer you a grok early access which is like a version of chat gpt that they created on their own okay you're not gonna get ads in for your page okay so you're not gonna have issues with that uh, this is something like you're paying for youtube premium you watch videos without ads then you have a reply boost we have edit post you know when you post on twitter you cannot edit your post if you misspell something you have to delete it so it's good that you have this function a longer post right you're no longer limited to particular uh, uh you know search terms or particular keywords or characters you can also undo post this is good because as we know sometimes you don't have other option you just have to delete it because you don't have undo post uh, you can post longer videos 
essentially you see a lot of people shifting from YouTube towards uh, to Twitter, right? So this is something that you also want to pay attention to if you are up to posting long form content. Also, you have top articles, you have reader, which if you click on the small information, read long threads minus the distractions. So again, this is uh, removing the ads, you know, making it easier for you to engage with the content and focus on the content. You have a background video playback, meaning you can play a video on Twitter and you can keep scrolling through the feed and read other Twitter uh, threads. So you don't have to, you know, close one piece of content to open another. You're able to download videos, same function as YouTube Premium on YouTube. On the flip side, you have a creator hub, right? You, this is where you can actually get paid to post. I made a couple of videos on the topic, how to get monetized, how much money you could make and the best strategy to do so. You want to make sure you check my videos on the topic here on the channel. They also have a created subscription. This is the second option, like I mentioned, for monetization. Uh, you have Media Studio, which if you click on the info, it will be manage, measure and monetize your media on X. That's all about like making money and analytics. Then you're gonna get the verification and security. Include the check mark, the encrypted direct message, the ID verification and two-factor authentication. Last but not least, you are going to get customization. Uh, you're going to get app icons. You're going to get bookmark folders, customiz customizable navigation, highlight types, hide your likes, hide your check marks. So essentially, they can power any like, desirable feature from Instagram, YouTube, you know, TikTok, and they place it here. It's cool. But I think the prices went up. Now it's starting at $22 when you click on it, right? essentially i remember this was like much cheaper I, if i'm not mistaken this was like to get monetized it was to, not to get monetized to get a uh, verification budget was like 10 dollars something like this you can save if you pay like a annual plan like 229 right instead of uh, paying 22 dollars because you're gonna save like 230 versus 265 so you're gonna save like 35 bucks let me know what you guys think about this uh would you willing to subscribe i think for people who are making content make makes much more sense than just an average user on the platform for more videos like this guys subscribe and like this video